Welcome to Thinkering 2. What happens when you buy those um, old or used lenses? They may come very dirty. Look at this one. I don't know if, if you can see the dirtiness. And many times they come with some fungus. So usually that's not a big deal. Uh, and that's why I'm, I want to share, uh, share with... Uh, you guys this uh the technique for cleaning cleaning the the fungus but basically the best um uh, the best uh, product is this hydrox peroxide it's h2o2 uh this is the well it's for lab stuff so you're gonna buy this on specific uh well retailers and they come uh, in a in a 34 at least this one is 34 percent uh, di uh, dilution but you don't want that strong so you're gonna you're gonna have to like, put carefully use gloves for that uh, and you're gonna dilute that to eight percent less than ten percent um so just dilute and put the glass inside disassemble it like that in the bag disassemble everything using gloves because it it, it it is very strong and put the glass inside for 10 minutes and and it's gonna kill everything all biological stuff is gonna be oxidized by this uh, and all the, the, the cells and fun, fungi stuff is gonna disappear. If the fungus is very deep into the lenses, uh, it, it might have already corroded a bit uh, on the surfaces of the glass or the coating or something like that. Uh, but anyway, it doesn't matter that much. It's not gonna affect uh, tons. So the best is just to clean everything before you go into the adventure because anyway, after you build the thing, you don't want to uh, disassemble it. Um, so this is a very good tip. It's, uh, it's important for, for cleaning. You can use it for whatever glass that's contaminated with fungus. This stuff here, it's quite nice. It's a very thick. Um, I think it's a bit of uh, it has a bit of cloth in, inside maybe so I, I bought this on, on, on Sam's Club um, and it's very thick and it has like long fibers so I think it's good for cleaning everything and a good idea particularly if you don't want to disassemble a lens and and the fungus is just in the, 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 the front portion what you could do is like prepare the solution dilute it Three, uh, ten percent, eighty percent, something like that, and then you cut here small sections of this material, and then you could like put it in the water, and just and just put put them uh, on top of here, uh, and 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 maybe you can uh, with this you could like put some drops of the liquid of the dilution, and let it rest for ten minutes or so. So it's gonna clean. It's gonna do the same as if you could like uh, put the, the glass inside, but of course just on, on the on the surface that is in contact with the glass. So you can use it to clean up even the the, the back portion of the well, the front with that method. So that's just what I want to I want to share before we go to the the office shop or whatever, where we are gonna disassemble everything with this one. And ideally, I'm gonna try to go to all the process, and by the end of the whatever number of videos we 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 manage to do, we're gonna put this inside, and we're gonna have a lot of one like this, operational working in the new anamorphic setup. Yeah, that's it. Thank you.